here we are underneath Mudda's sink. Now I'm going to have to take this off, and uh, that's probably what's going on. Usually, usually the uh, trap is up a little bit higher. Okay, this is this is pretty pretty uh, low from here, and so there's probably some hair right down in here. Usually, I can stick the uh, the zip it. Usually I can get this zip it all the way down. Well, in fact, I, I've got it put, it's, it's pushed down. Actually, it, it does go down in there, but it's got to be down in here. And there's a nut right here, and there's a nut right there. So all I've got to do is loosen those up. Before I do that, I know that I've got to get a bucket. Because, see, the water dumps out right here. So straight across... This is all full of water right here, from here to there. Okay, if the sink was plugged up and it wasn't draining, then all of this would be full of water too. Well, chances are it drained, it drained a little bit, didn't it? So from about here to there, this has water, so I've gotta, I've gotta clean the, uh, I've gotta take all this stuff out from underneath the sink. And then I've gotta find a tub a little small bucket or just a uh, plastic uh, bowl or something and fit it down in there. I'll have to get my channel locks out because there's a big nut here. And sometimes you can loosen these up by hand. Okay, other times you can't. I'll try it by hand first, but I gotta get I gotta get kind of set up. Gotta get all this stuff out of here. Get my bucket, get my channel locks and get all ready to go. We'll see what else is down there because I gotta have the, I gotta have this sink draining a lot better than what it's doing now. Okay. I got the culprit right behind me, but she doesn't want to be on video. <laughs> She's only got her nightgown on. Oh mother. <laughs> so you're the dirty culprit who has caused this to happen. I guess I am. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so I think there's some more hair caught around that and this is I, I may have to pull that apart too, but my first my first thing is to get this and see I found a little Container here. I'm gonna put that underneath that I've got I've got a pair of pliers here now. That's obviously that's not big enough But that's gonna get me to get the pop-up valve out. I got to loosen up a nut over here and this plunger holds the pop-up at the bottom of the pop-up there's a little round hole or a notch and that that goes up and down when you pull the back when you pull the back of this here and then that makes the pop-up go up and down and sometimes people have this disconnected from that little that little uh, plunger and then you can pull this out all the time but most times people have it hooked up like this okay I'm gonna pull that out too. And I've got my channel locks here. Okay. And I got like a medium size channel locks. I'm first gonna just try to loosen up this nut by hand. Sometimes, sometimes this is you can loosen it righty tighty, lefty loosey, right? Nope, it's tight. It's tight. And let's see. Let's see about this one here. See, that's tight too. Okay, so I'm gonna have to uh, hopefully I can get these and I can adjust my channel locks. That's why I have like a medium, a medium size. I gotta make sure I'm going the right way. Okay. Come on. This has been on here for a while, hasn't it? I haven't, I haven't, I've had to uh, unplug this sink a few times, but I've always been able to do it with the zip it from up above. Okay, so now I got that nut loose. I'm going to have to do this one up here. And see, the, the thing about righty tighty lefty loosey for loosening these things, this one, because the nut is facing down, I've got to turn it to the right to loosen it up not the left okay so it's just 
Okay, there it goes. Okay. I'll take this out. Let's loosen this nut all the way. Okay, now it's up there. I'm giving my mother a crash course, so next time she can do it, right, mother? <laughs> I don't think so. You don't think so? No. Oh, any any average Joe can do this. Oh, I see some some yuckies in there. Oh gosh. Uh, you know, not not too bad, but but we'll have to get something uh, a toothbrush and. Oh, I got one out here. Do you do you have one of those long things that's a little cleaner thing that's got bristles on it and it has a flexible end on it, like a cleaning. Like a brush, like yeah. a bottle brush. Yeah. Yeah. You do? Yeah. Okay. And okay. You want that? Yeah. And uh, and a little uh, old toothbrush. A toothbrush. Yeah. Okay. My assistant is on her way doing her thing and see I can I can get up through there lots of times there's a nut back here you can undo this nut too, pull this section off if need be and and fish something down from here that way clean out this but what they did here is they had the regular ABS pipe coming out of the wall here and they just glued two fittings together they got a uh, Oh, a, an eighth bend or quarter turn and then a 90 and they've just got both of those glued in so that's kind of unusual okay so my guess is we probably got some hair up in here clogged right up in there so I've got to I've got to loosen that up oh wow look at that that nut was finger tight that shouldn't be like that usually if you get it finger tight um, it might drip from there so see I've, I've got that I've loosened that little thing right there I'm gonna, I'm gonna pull that back and I'm just gonna kind of I'm just gonna kind of leave that dangling now now I can get up here and pull this let's see well, there's not a whole lot on there I can clean that up pretty good okay see see the holes it's one or one or the other and this is a universal type and uh, it might fit there it might fit there okay all right what you got here for me mother oh there she goes look it see there it's got a flexible end on it very nice here's an old toothbrush okay what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna I'm gonna take this out side and put some water in a uh, five gallon bucket I think we probably got one somewhere and then I'll I'll clean this there okay that way oh, I don't have okay. to do it down here okay slowly but surely we're gonna get this now let's just see if we can if, if any of this is plugged up I don't I don't think it really is but um I'm getting I'm getting a little little bit of sledge through here not 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 too much and I can take my I wish she had a little bit smaller one but I don't think I don't think she does I'm gonna have to kind of bend this up in there and hope that I don't get it stuck huh Okay, I should probably put my gloves on for this. Let's see, Joe. Last time I did this, people had a fit that I didn't have my gloves on. See, I, I've had, I've got one of these that is is a lot smaller, and I could fish it right up in there. Yeah. But but it, it it it's pretty. It's loose. And now I have to wipe out all that stuff later. Don't pour it down the drain. Yeah, don't pour it down the drain. I was just going to turn the water on. 
<laughs> to wash my hands. You we do that. Do make, the laundry make sure you got make sure you got a bucket underneath you. Okay, I'm gonna I've got a bucket outside and I'm gonna clean that other thing. See what we get out of there.